Hey students, welcome back to another week in graphic design using canva.com. This week we're going to make a Facebook post. Let's get started. You're going to come here to the home page of canva.com, click on the blue button as usual, and find in the list Facebook post. Now you don't have to have a Facebook account to complete this assignment. If you don't have one, that's okay. Just complete the assignment as usual and then click the share button to share it with me and I will be able to grade it. So we have an empty, uh, empty page here um, that we can work with and it's given a certain size that uh, works well with a Facebook post. I want to make a Facebook post for Memorial Day. I want to honor a veteran in my life. So in order to do that, I'm going to search for Memorial Day. And as soon as I search for Memorial Day up here at the top and search bar, I'm going to see all kinds of pre-made designs that will work really great for Memorial Day. Okay, I found over here a design that I like. I'm going to click on it. And when I click on it, it places the graphic elements here uh, in the editing area. And uh, I would like to change out this picture to use a picture of my own choosing. So I'm going to click on that. And I'm going to click the delete button, which is going to get rid of that. And um, then I'm going to go ahead and put some pictures over here on the right that I choose to use instead. So I'm going to come over here to the photos section on the left. And again, to find pictures that I like, I would like to have maybe uh, some pictures of an American flag. And when I put that in there, I see some great pictures. I like this one with the eagle. So I'm going to click on it, which will add the picture. It's too big, so I can just grab it from the corner and drag it, obviously, and make it a bit different size. So I'm going to kind of fill up this right-hand side of the design with some pictures. I think probably three pictures will fit in there. So I've got that first one. Uh, here's another picture that I think I'll use. I'll go ahead and place that in here. Again, I have to resize it to make this work. That's the nice thing about Canva. It's really super easy to use. Uh, I can even kind of cause these images to kind of overlap a little bit. And so I think I'll do that to make a bit more room down here. Uh, this image here, I think I want to uh, bring it to the forward because I want that in front. And then last but not least, I think I want a picture of a soldier since um, this is all about veterans. So I come in here and I go down and find this picture of an American soldier and place that lower right corner, resize that as well. And there you go. Now I have a, a, really, a great design. I need to simply name it as we've been naming all of our posts. Uh, this is lesson six, so I'm gonna put a six there. And then my last name, and then my first name, and then um, either blue one or blue two, based on which class you're in. And uh, that will save it properly, hit enter to save it. And then you need to click the share button. When you do that, you choose Krista Bruin's team here and change the eyeball to Ken view then I can view it, so can everyone else in the class. And uh, now I can grade it. And again, you have to do that or I won't be able to grade your work. Last but not least, I want you to download a JPEG version of this. So click on the download button here and change the PNG version to JPEG uh, and make it as small a size as possible. That will help us upload it to Moodle. Quality can stay at 80%. Hit the download button and it will download. Once you've downloaded it and your design has been published, you can go back to your home page and you're done. Once you download your image, you'll need to upload it to Moodle to turn it in and then you'll be done with this assignment. I hope you're all doing well. One last thing I'd like to do is encourage you to share your design with an actual veteran, someone in your life that you know that has actually served our country in the military. You could just forward or, or share that image that you just created with them on their Facebook page. Or if they don't have a Facebook page, just send the, send the image to them um, by email or print it out and give it to them. Uh, I'd encourage you to do that. It's not required in the assignment, but I think that would be a great thing to do. Okay. Hope you're doing well. Staying safe. See you next week.